Hello students. Today we are going to start a new chapter. What pet formatting? What pet? Why? What is the use of this program? Yes, we have learned in our previous chapter that word pad is used for typing. Which part of computer we use for typing? Yes, it is the keyboard. Keyboard we use for typing and the program we word pad we use for typing. Now in this chapter we will learn about formatting. What is the mean of format? this formatting is applied on the text whatever we write in the word pad we can change the color of that text we can change the size of that text we can change the style of the text so changing the font color font size font style font face is called text formatting i repeat changing the font size font face font color font style is called text formatting and when we apply the formatting on the text it's we change its appearance and we make it attractive so we format a text to change its appearance or to make it attractive so it looks attractive in the word pad changing the font face color size etc of a text is called character or text formatting we format our text to change its appearance or to make it attractive different types of tools are available in wordpad to format text now what is the mean of font face a font face means the type face or the outlook of the text how it looks like how the text looks like that is called its font face in this chapter first we will learn how we can change the font face what are the steps to change the font face now i have told you already that what is font face it is the looks or appearance of text we can change the style writing style of the text how we can change it word first we will open the word pad we have learned already that how we can open the word pad so after opening the word pad we will find this kind of word pad window so in the word pad window first we will go to the home tab you can see at the below the title bar this is the bar in this first we will select the home tab you can see here yes yeah, this is the home tab then after that in this is the font family this is the font family we will click on the font family list box that is font group you can see here this is the font place from where we can change the font face or font type so first we will click on the home tab then in the font group we will click on the font family then as soon as we will click on this drop down arrow a list of the different different font faces or font types will appear on the screen you can see that this kind of list or style will appear on the screen we can select any of the font any of the style by clicking suppose if you want to this font style we will click on the c click how we how do we click click we use mouse for clicking 
तो वी विल ब्रिंग द माउस पॉइंटर ऑन एनी ऑफ द फोन टाइल एंड देन वी कैन वी विल डू द लेफ्ट क्लिक एंड आफ्टर दैट वी कैन स्टार्ट द टाइपिंग दिस इज हाउ वी कैन चेंज द फोन फेस आफ्टर सेलेक्टिंग अ पर्टिकुलर फोन द टैक्स विल अपियर इन द सेलेक्टेड फोन दिस इज हाउ वी कैन चेंज द लुक ऑफ द टेक्स्ट नाउ वी विल लर्न हाउ वी कैन चेंज द कलर दैट इज रियली वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग यू कैन सी दैट इफ वी टाइप इन द वर्ड पेड इट इज जनरली इन ब्लैक कलर कैन यू सी योर बुक इन दिस बुक ऑल द टेक्स इज इन ब्लैक कलर सेम इन द वे वर्ड पेड इन द वर्ड पेड द टेक्स्ट इज इन द ब्लैक कलर बट यू कैन सी हियर दैट this font is this text is typed in the pink color so in the same way we can change the font color in the word pad let's learn how we can do that yes how we can change the font color students as we use the pencil to write in a notebook it write in the black color same in the way as we type in word pad it is in black color now but the text i have told you already that we can change in any color other than the bl black color so i'll show you the example yes you can see that this text is written in the red color we can change the typing in the blue color green color pink orange yellow any color we can type according to our choice let's learn how we can change the text color or typing color first we have to go to the word pad window how we can go first we will go to the home tab you can see here when we will open the word pad window on the first we will select the home tab that this is the you can see here font is written so for in the font group we will select of the font color this is the option from where we can choose the color as soon as we will select the option a you can see here as soon as we will click on the option a list with different grade of color or a color palette will appear on the screen you can select any of the color according to your choice then after suppose i have chosen the red color then as soon as i will select the red color and after i will start the typing the text would be in the red color you can change or you can choose any of the color according to your choice so we have learned how we can change the color of the text i'll show you again first we'll go to the home tab then in the font group we will select the text color this is the option for the text color we will click on that then the a uh, color palette will appear we can select any of the color then after i will start typing then the text would be in the selected color you can choose any of the color i'll here yeah, this is the example how we can change the color of the text so students we have learned till now we have learned how we can change the font style or appearance and how we can change the font color now we will learn how we can change the font size and font style students can you see here that this text is and this text what is the difference between the difference is this 
text or this line letter r is in small and this words are big so the size of the this letter sorry this word and this word the size is different in the same way we can put the words or text in wordpad in the different different sizes let's learn how we can change the size of the text or font font size how we can change the font size yes in the wordpad window first we'll go to the home tab then from the font group we will click on the font size list box you can see this drop down arrow we will click on the drop down arrow click how do we click by mouse so we will click on the drop down arrow then we can select any of the number if you want to increase if you want to increase the size of the word then we will select the bigger number and if you want to make the text in small we can select the smaller number so we can select any of the number to make the text big or small that's how we can change the font size i'll tell you again first go to the home tab we will click on the home tab then we will click on the font size list box then a list of numbers will appear and we can choose any of the number so students we have learned how we can make the font smaller and how we can change the font bigger by choosing the higher number now we will learn how we can change the font style what is the font style font style means we can change the font in bold italic or underline now what is the mean of bold bold means the text is little darker than normal text can you see the difference between these words and this word what is the difference yes this text is darker or thicker than normal text this is written normally but this font style is written in the dark so if we select the option bold the text would be little darker than normal text so how we can change the make the text bold first we go to the home tab then in the font group we will select the option b this sign b is for the bold option now the text when after selecting the bold b option the text will appear bolder than rest of text can you see the difference here here written i am 6 years 6 years is little darker than i am this means 6 years are in the bold color so the text type after clicking on b or bold button appears in bolder form you can see the difference now we will learn how we can change the text italic now italic what is the mean of italic italic means the text is in slanting form what is the slanting can you see this pen this is kept as straight now if i will turn this like what is the difference the text is the pen is in little bit slanting so if we select the italic option the text would be typed a little bit slanting you can see the difference in this example i am 6 years this text is written normally but this old is written slanting means little bit slanting okay so 
इटैलिक ऑप्शन मेक द टेक्स्ट लिटिल बिट स्लॉन्टिंग हाउ वी कैन चेंज इट फर्स्ट वी गो टू द होम टैब देन इन द फोन ग्रुप वी विल सिलेक्ट द आई ऑप्शन आई आई मीन्स इटैलिक नाउ इफ आफ्टर सिलेक्टिंग द आई और इटैलिक ऑप्शन द टेक्स्ट वुड बी अपियर इन इटैलिक और स्लॉन्टिंग फॉर्म एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू रिमूव द स्लाइड वी वी कैन अगेन क्लिक ऑन आई देन वी विल द स्टाइल विल बी रिमूव सो दैट्स हाउ वी कैन चेंज द टेक्स्ट इन इटैलिक और स्लॉन्टिंग फॉर्म नाउ इन द लास्ट वी विल लर्न हाउ वी कैन मेक द टेक्स्ट अंडरलाइंड students as we are writing in our notebook if you want to show that some text is important or some words are important we underline them what is the mean of underline making a line below the text or words to show it's important or to for any reason so how we can underline the text first go we'll go to the home tab then in the font group we will select the u option it is written this is how we can see this option in the font group we will select the u option u means underline then when we will select the on or select or on the underline option the text would be underlined means there would be a line below the text so students we can change the text as underlined by selecting the underlined option and if you want to remove this style we will click again on the underline button to remove this style so students in this chapter we have learned how we can apply the text formatting what is the mean of text formatting means changing the font face font color and font size and style in the font face we have learned how we can change the look of the text then we can also change the color of the text then we learned how we can 